CBN independence is sacrosanct. First, I will start by saying I'm, I was surprised to see that the Supreme Court decision was not respected by the president. I'm surprised about that. It's unfortunate if the president says anything otherwise. Because it's, it will seem like we are living in a, in, a, in, in, in a lawless society where the highest court in the, in the land will make a pronouncement and the president will go otherwise. They have not said anything. Then why is banks now paying old Naira notes? The fact that they say the new Naira note do the circulation and the old Naira note now, with the same will begin use. Bank don't begin to release the money they give us, but some people for street. So they collect the money since CBN never approved and president never talk anything concerning the uh, old Naira note. If the president does not speak yet, no market woman will collect that money from your hand. Neither would any bank collect it because they received directive from their regulator which is CBN, Apex Bank. I am not surprised because it's part of the confusion of this present administration. We have seen quite a number of issues where the APC has been fighting the APC. The judiciary as an arm of government is not collaborating with the executive as an arm of government. I also discovered that uh, many people, many Nigerians are still confused on the way forward concerning the currency. But if the president speaks, which I believe is the one that gave his instruction in the first place to the CBN governor to carry out the policy, so it solves the problem. Many of us, as as you can see, see the way Q there for bank. I don't really know what's happening, so I just feel the policy is not really working and old notes we are not seeing, new notes we are not seeing. And for now, the Supreme Court had said again that 1,200 and the 500 should run. I think it's uh, uh, a due time for the executive to look at that decision again because if they continue doing that, it means then that we don't have a country. If the, if the, if the, if the laws of the country cannot work, then the president should not also be on his seat because it is the loss of the country that is keeping him to be where he is. But also, in the first instance, you know, these issues are not issues that was supposed to, it was a political issue. It was not supposed to be a legal issue because this decision by the Supreme Court in itself is going to create a problem. What is the problem? CBN will not recover from this in a long time because CBN independence is sacrosanct. And I think it will be in the good interest of the whole nation if the president can just uh, obey the Supreme Court uh, order, which is to really set precedence, an example to every other citizen, that I, as the number one citizen of the country, am a law-abiding president. So nobody will have an excuse not to obey the law when the president has already shown an example as a law-abiding president. So I think it is just new. Sometimes you have to swallow your pride. Uh, you have to let go certain things just for the generality and the well-being of your citizens. And I think no Nigerian is happy. The thing has really affected everyone until now, even after the presidential election. Things are still not the way they're supposed to be. So which I think the brand should place the welfare and the well-being of the citizens above whatever policy is trying to pull through. Nigerians cannot cope with cashless policy. It cannot work in Nigeria because we are suffering. Oh, we are suffering.